Yes, uh, welcome back to TNX Uganda. Uh, in today's video, I want to show you how you can set up your MTN API. Yes, so uh, someone may ask, uh, where can I use this API? For the developers no, software developers no, and those with big organizations. Uh, this API is used in uh, mostly on online transactions when you are doing online transaction. Let's say you are buying something on Jumia or any other online shop. You reach somewhere on the checkout and they tell you you choose the payment method. When you choose let's say MTN, then uh, you choose the price that you select the product. You select the payment method and the prompt will come to your phone. That, that prompt coming on your phone, you put the pin and the money goes to the other side of the of the of the vendor, someone who is selling you the product. So uh, that comes when you have the API. That system uses the API to connect with the MTN server to be able to send the client the prompt to pay. And many other services, uh, any man, uh, and many other organizations use this service. So uh, today I want to take you through how you can really use uh, or set up that API. First, you come to the uh, to API. Uh, you have to you practice using uh, a sandbox environment. Sandbox gives you the the ability to practice to see how you'll be able to develop it in the uh, in the live uh, or active API so what you do you first come to here you sign up where you see here you come there and sign up you see me I'm signed in but when you have not seen you sign in so once you sign in you access such a page then when you see you can uh, you can visit home here and we see Yeah. As you can see, guys, say get started with our API. So you can read this uh, documentation. If you don't read the documentation, my friend, you may not achieve what you want. It is a lot that you need to do. Here, you read all the documentation. You see test cases. You test. Yes. So after testing, when you are when you have gotten all the concept from the documentation then you come subscribe to the product under products there are different products we have corrections uh, widget we have uh, corrections corrections this is how uh, maybe if that is when you are pulling money from uh, like you are getting money from the clients money will be coming to corrections disbandment this is used when you are maybe paying out salaries, when you want to pay in bulk, paying out salaries, sending out some money in bulk. You will use uh, uh, this, uh, this banment, as you can read it, say to market the post fund is to multiple users. Yes, so here they are telling you corrections, enable remote corrections of bills, fees, and taxes. Then remittance, this is when uh, uh you want to do to do the transfer from abroad from different countries as you can see uh the writing there is uh, remit funds to local recipients from diaspora with ease so if you want to get money from diaspora you can do it with ease with a remittance product so here you select what you want after selecting it let's say you want uh, corrections you come and subscribe for it you do the subscription of it yes so you come here and you do subscription you click on subscription you subscribe you subscribe it as you can see me i, I subscribed it long time yeah so you do that subscription so once you are done then you can come to api sandbox to practice on how you can develop it yes so you come to sandbox and practice as you can see 
uh, here they are telling this is the collection they have opened the collections this is what you do they give you try you can even try they give you the steps what you need to put in the header the body everything and the response that you will get yes so you have to practice once you practice these ones and you get the response they are giving you here it means you will be able to practice with the production environment yes so now when you are done with practicing here you can come here to go live you submit your documentation to MTN to verify you and they give you the rights to use their API thereby going to the as you can see they are telling you ready to move to production follow the easy steps so you follow steps here you enter the country and follow the steps here and arrive you submit yes so then they will be able to to verify your documents and uh, once you pass then they will give you a, a production environment remember this is a testing environment you test using sandbox but once you are approved by MTN they give you a production environment there is a lot of documentation that you need to do to submit here yeah so that's it if you want to do API uh, that's where the process goes through if you, are, you still don't get it you can I will leave my number in description you can whatsapp me or call me and we talk uh, if you need me maybe to help you set it up i can help you set it up so um i think that's all i wanted to tell you uh, if you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing and hit that like button such that this video can spread to many people yeah so let's catch up in another video